Hello students, today in this graph, this column graph, I am going to discuss, uh, there, there are three methods of waste disposal which are given. The three methods are landfill, burning and dumping in sea and the amount of waste which is disposed by these methods is given on the y-axis uh, in million tons and the three, three years um, which are given are on the x-axis that is 2005, 2006 and 2008. The given bar graph illustrates three methods of disposal of waste materials in 2005, 2006 and 2008. So this, this is the introduction. Um, this is uh, this I have made from the uh, question topic that is given here. Uh, now I have written the overview. Overall, landfill method was the most used for waste disposal in 2005. You can see this is the landfill method it was the most used. While dumping in sea was used the maximum in 2008. Dumping in sea was used the maximum in 2008. So I have given the maximum of this year and the maximum of that and I have compared. Okay. <clears throat> it can be seen that landfill sites, uh, landfill method lost popularity but dumping in sea gained popularity over the, um, in the given time. The least waste was burnt in all the three years. Now you can see this is the burning method and uh, total out of the total waste, this is the least in all the three years, the least waste was burnt and the amount of waste disposed by this method fluctuated. You can see it, it was this much, then went up to this much and then came down. So the amount of waste disposed by this method fluctuated. So you can see that uh, this is... Uh, uh, this uh, uh, overview does not have any data only I have written about the years no data is given and I have used words like the most used the use the maximum loss popularity gain popularity least waste and the <clears throat> fluctuated I've used all these words these words uh, give trends and these words uh, give comparisons so uh, this is a good method of writing the overview now only the um, uh, body is left in which we can use the data. About 2000 million tons of waste was disposed by landfill method in 2005. So this is 2005 and this is 2000. So 2000 million tons of waste was disposed by landfill method in 2005. This figure decreased moderately over time and by 2008 only 1200 million ton waste was landfill. Now see the use of the units MT. MT stands for million tons and decreased moderately uh, means that uh, like from 12, 2000 it has come to uh, 1200. So this is a moderate decrease and uh, I have used the verb adverb combination decreased is the verb moderately is the adverb. So the verb comes before the adverb and uh, moderately decreased would be wrong. So decrease, this is, these are common mistakes which I which come across when I check the notebook. So that's why I'm speaking them here so that you can avoid them. So this figure decreased moderately over time and by 2008 only 1200 million tons waste was landfilled. Now uh, this uh, disposed by landfill, waste was landfilled. You can see how um, how to use this terminology also. About 900 million tons of waste was burnt. This is 900 uh, in 2005. However, however, there was a considerable increase. Um, however, there was a considerable increase. Now, this is the adjective noun combination. Increase is the noun. And before increase, I have used the adjective that is considerable. So, considerable increase is the adjective noun combination. Either you can use a verb adverb combination or the adjective noun combination. If I had written uh, this figure increased considerably, it would have been correct, but the combination would have been verb adverb, but I have made a combination with the adjective noun. However, there was a considerable increase in this figure and in 2006, approximately 1200 million ton waste was incinerated. So this is incinerated is the synonym for burnt. So you can, you can say uh, waste was incinerated. Now this word uh, you must learn because there are many graphs. Uh, sometimes in the pie chart this graph comes sometimes in the form of a table about the methods of waste disposal. So these words uh, are a must know vocabulary for 
the IELTS students. <coughs> so about 1200 million tons were dumped in sea. Now you can say this 1200 million tons was dumped in sea uh, in 2005. There was a gradual rise um, in the amount of uh, in the amount dumped in sea and by 2008 about 1650 million ton waste was thrown in sea oh i haven't written uh, about uh, i haven't written about this year about the uh, figure that is burnt so in 2006 1200 million tons was incinerated this figure dropped again dropped and dropped uh, dropped significantly and by 2008 and by 2008 this is how much this is about again about 900 uh, approximately nine hundred empty waste was burnt about so this is about the that that was left out somehow so I've added it. So 2,000 million tons of waste was disposed by landfill method. This figure decreased moderately and by 2008 only 1,200 million tons was landfilled. About 900 million tons of waste was burnt. However, there was a considerable increase in this figure and in 2006, approximately 1,200 million tons waste was incinerated. This figure dropped significantly and, and nearly. So this is, uh, I've used the word uh, approximately, so I can say roughly roughly um, 900 million tons waste was burnt about 1200 million tons was dumped in sea there was a gradual rise and by 2008 about 1650 million tons was thrown in sea now you can see that for the amount landfilled i have not given this figure because this is just going down gradually so and for uh, dumping in sea also i have not given the figure for 2006 so you have to pick and choose the main features but for uh, burning this figure rose then then again fell so i've given all the figures so this is uh, about the graph which i've written i hope you have liked it and learned something how to go about writing the graph thank you very much for watching patiently